after a good meal, you need a good coffee. Um, in fact, I don't take any sugar or milk. I drink it the French way, but uh, it's nice too. And here we have a Beaumont 18 year old, which will love being matched with these little creme brulee or chocolat, chocolate creme brulee, um, which is a nibble. Uh, you can have, instead of having a piece of dark chocolate, you do your little creme brulee, which is mainly dark, good dark chocolate, 70% cacao minimum, uh, melted with uh, all the ingredients of a creme brulee, yolks, cream, a little bit of milk and sugar. And you cook very gently. You mustn't uh, be overcooked. And uh, then you add the, the dark sugar and make a caramel with it. And a dash of this Boomer 18, which is heavily sherried. So it's, there's a lot of uh, rich, um, fruity, and, and the fruitiness of the whiskey goes uh, on top of the chocolate, the sort of touch, bitter touch of the chocolate. It's uh, really satisfying, rewarding, but you can't have a lot. So that's why I, I do little, very little um, portions. But you know, if you are a real sweet too, if you could have two. The coffee comes after the whiskey. So I would do chocolate first, the whiskey. And that funny enough, the chocolate enhance the, the, the smokiness of uh, this 18-year-old, which if you drink it on, on its own, you won't find a lot of, of smoky aromas and flavor. But with chocolate, it's sort of just as if it was bursting out. And you finish with, according to me, that's my taste, you would finish with, with a coffee. And again, you start the game another time and another time, and you have here you have seven of them, so enough for a good good evening and a, a small shot of whiskey. And uh, the fire, the fire is dying out a little, but uh, another um, peat and uh, another log of uh, wood, and uh, here we go for for the night. We can carry on the whole night with that. Bon appétit.